It's Link. Pretty. But, but he's not on. He's not on one side. He's not on another side. He's between. Between between worlds. Is he? I don't know. Street pass. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, hold on. Uh. Whoops. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> that's really cute, but that's not what I'm gonna do. Aww. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay, good. There we go. <laughs> Thiefed it. So I don't know how well this will run. Um, it is listed as okay on Citra. Early tests indicate pretty good. This is running fine right now, so. Yeah. Oh, we lost. I fucked up already. Oh, well. I've never had uh, Citra bring up a a thing like like it just did, where it was like, uh, type in pass? type in your name there. But I think that's because it's using the Nintendo interface to type in a name. Yeah. Better be important. <laughs> I don't remember any of this. Oh yeah, aren't you like the blacksmith's assistant or something in this one? Yes. Yeah. What the two gnomes? No, no, you're like a. He's like a normal blacksmith. Oh, okay. Majora's Mask oh, Majora's just over mask. there. Yep. Yeah. Let us know when we need to put on our 3D glasses. <laughs> um, <laughs> I can turn on 3D, I guess, but no one would be able to experience it unless you have your 3D glasses. Are they just like the movie theater 3D glasses? Uh, so. I don't, I don't actually know. I feel like they'd have to be, yeah. So like the clear ones. Yeah, it wouldn't be the red and blue ones. Mm-hmm. I like when they're unaware of mechanics and they're just like, I don't know why I just explained that. I find that mm -hmm. that gimmick consistently entertaining. Hell yeah, let's go. I remember that sound. Do you remember that? Mm hmm. Look, you can pick up pots without needing a bracelet. Tarks! Yeah. Subscription for two months. Thank you so much, Tarks. <laughs> Would you look at that? Would you look at that? <laughs> I was thinking, uh, you can you can do cameo for Virgil's voice actor. What's a Virgil voice actor thing that he'd say? W would it be like subscribe to Hello Katie Joey, Hell Droll in, in a Virgil voice? Would that work? Oh. Huh? Hmm. Oh. No. I'm thinking. I said, oh. Um. Hmm. How droll. <laughs> That's Virgil. I mean, that would work. <laughs> I mean, that is kind of Virgil. Um, he's still my star in my tree, by the way. Oh, Virgil. Tark said, Tark, <laughs> Tark said he knows about timed hits. <laughs> Never forget, Virgil's voice actor was a Power Ranger. Really? Oh, yeah. Which one? Not the not the one that was like like killed his roommate or something, right? I mean, no. <laughs> was it the Red Ranger? Red Ranger killed his roommate. No, but he was in gay porn. 
Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> no, because I thought it was the Red Ranger that killed his roommate, too. Oh, maybe. I don't know. Both. I know I don't he know. was in a, a solo scene. Secret For lives me. of Power Rangers. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this? Well, well, if it isn't Beef Tip. I don't know why I gave him that voice. <laughs> but you'd better mend your ways, lad. There's no future in being a layabout. <laughs> My news source, the Daily Mail, says this. <laughs> it was the Quantum Ranger from Time Force. That's not even... Hell yeah. Power Ranger. Sure it is. This is it has a ranger right in it. I'm sure he has some sort of power. There you go. Done. What color was he? Quantum. Quantum. <laughs> <laughs> Quantum color. Oh, okay. The cap the captain. Left without his sword, and Papa has tasked us to deliver it. I can't even use it yet. Because it's not your sword. Uh, well. <laughs> it Rich, could. Power Ranger is in jail. <laughs> <laughs> the sixth the... Ranger of the Time Force. Okay. Does this blacksmith have a strange beard or a really big stash? Both. Yeah, like a combination of the two, I think. An outbreak of Paintings vandalism. Paintings everywhere! Yeah, who would paint Hyrule Castle like that? Rude. Hmm. I'm sure it's nobody. Banksy, maybe. Having Gin eat like a Big Mac or something. These are all, like, Power Rangers that are older. Like, further down the line. The one that stabbed it was also from that, um, Wild whatever. Oh, the Quantum Rangers? Yeah, Wild Force, that's it. Quantum oh, Ranger so, murderers! So Virgil was associated with the murder. <laughs> I mean, maybe... Virgil voice acting. They are, um... What's it called when they're... Acquaintances. Yeah. Hey. Hey. You knock that off. Sorry. Uh-oh. Uh oh. It's all your fault, Dampy. It's because it's a push, not a pull. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dig your way in. Come on. I'm scared. Scared. B but I can't. Get out there. Okay, fine. fine. <laughs> gonna work. You got a sword. Sure, Dampe. Wolf, I'm always scared. Uh, by the way, I am drinking a hot white chocolate Ooh, with Baileys. Yeah. Does it come with Baileys, or did you add that? I added Baileys. <laughs> so what if you said, play? <laughs> what if you? Yes. What if you said no and play the game as Dampy? 
<laughs> You'd have a shovel. Ooh, lantern? That's right. I'm so smart. So now I think I did this where I can, yeah, I could just do that and I don't have to actually use the, the touch screen on my very real 3DS right in front of me. Bailey's on a school night? <laughs> it's like basically Wednesday, so yeah. I mean, I just have my amaretto today. Did you get orange juice? No, I just have amaretto over iced right now. I have two oranges, but it would take effort for me to actually oh. cut them and juice no. them. No, don't do that. That is too much effort. Yeah. For a Tuesday afternoon, it is way too much effort. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I gotta juice my oranges for my booze. Ooh, I was, I was no. straight up not looking. <laughs> Alright, now would be a great time to put on your 3D glasses that you've all been provided. If you watch this channel and gave Ryan your address. I know where you live. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I remember it was cool that they had like multiple levels yeah. on this. Yeah. Yay! Tark's the 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 music in this game is really, really good. Oh. And I like it that they use the sound effects of like newer Zelda games. Like the chest opening and stuff. Mm -hmm. I honestly, Ed, yeah, it is more um it's about equal Baileys and hot chocolate. <laughs> I remember making well, Baileys this... itself is like sweeter liquor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I remember making this last time with milk, and it was way too rich, so I did water. Wait, well, too late now. That just means I you had to add more Baileys. That's true. That would be very heavy. <laughs> <laughs> well, if this is so, uh... I like mixing like milk and water when I do hot chocolate. Well, if this is a 3DS, I'm using a program called Citra. Although there's a way to hack your 3DS and have it actually send the video signal over Wi-Fi, which sounds very unreliable, but... Oh yeah, that sounds super... Iffy. But it's cool if it were... if it worked. <laughs> Emu yeah, you're right, Tark. This is the real deal. Um, I'm passing it through Citra to up-res it, you see. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, yeah, Yuga's music. <laughs> you gonna get out of here if you know it's good for you. I said, you gonna get... Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. Ha 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 Oh man. This is a good game, so I feel less inclined to texture mod. But you can in Citra. <laughs> and there's a lot of pink. I think Ryan would go to your place and murder you. <laughs> <laughs> What have you done to my beautiful game? <laughs> you change all the sages' pictures to something else. Different Just, Mountain Dews. Tacos. I was going to say different pictures tacos. of... <laughs> tacos. <laughs> Just straight up tacos, all of them. The I was going to say John that. Madden. Different pictures of John Madden in each no, one. No, this priest here is John You've Madden. all come to learn Not my me, three maybe. jokes, which is <laughs> Mountain Dew, Taco Bell, and John Madden. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's not true. I had more than that in, uh, in, um, yeah, Nicolas Cage was in, uh, 
<laughs> if we're doing Zelda like Majora's Mask, Nicolas Cage was the was the real deal. Oh shit. Yeah, but that was Termina. Termina was obsessed with Nicolas Cage. That's true. All of his movies. God, yeah, I wish that they had them posted everywhere. I wish, I wish that moon texture worked. Ooh. Dampa comes running in. Guys, I got in! <laughs> <laughs> no, he needs to do that like at the end of the game. He I made needs it. to not be in this game. Aww. Give Dampa some love. They forced Dampa into this game. They forced him into. <laughs> if, there's Link's a into... The... if there's a graveyard, there's a Dampa. They forced him in Link's Awakening. There was no graveyard. Not that you know of. Awakening? He just buries he just yeah. buries the bodies everywhere. He the world the, was like, in the oh, graveyard. Yeah. You're right, you're the right. The temple building thing and yeah. awakening. Bravio. I remember the pictures. I remember this guy. I can't even remember playing this. Yeah, I thought like, Link's I... Awakening had a graveyard. Sorry, I, I was reading what Tark said. It it does, but it's over by, like, by the witch. Um, and that's where you would get your different uniform when they got Link's Awakening in color. Um, so you could go in there and find the color dungeon. But that's not where Dompe was either in the Switch version. Sorry, Katie, I completely cut you off. Fine. I get cut off. Oh, no, you're fine. Um, no, I was just saying, I just remember, I remember this guy, and I remember the pictures, but I really don't remember playing this game. It'll or I don't remember parts of the game. But I got it, what, for Christmas, like, years ago now? Yeah, you can crash here. I also like Ravio. Mm -hmm. I like the bird thing. The snoot snoot. Yeah. Oh, I thought he blew a kiss at you. <laughs> it looked like it for a second. I was like, oh. He's very thankful. Okay. Ah, this song's good. So you let him stay in your house. He's going to totally wreck your house, by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, he's just staying until, you know, until he gets back Things... up on his feet and... I get it. This must have been yes. where I stopped when I was testing, because you were like, Ravio, what the heck is this? What the heck is this? I think was your exact what you exa what you said exactly. Okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> Impa! They kind of wedged her in this game, I think. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> they forced her in this mm -hmm. one. <laughs> yeah. And this game has a lot of dorks, and I kind of love it. I kind of love the, the the look they took with this game. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
We're uprising right now to 720. I could push 1080, but... I liked the steady frame rate that we were getting with 720 for the most part. Until we get into a new area in which it chugs for like a second and then... Like that. <laughs> they do like like Nutcracker dolls. <laughs> Sounds like a Barnes and Noble in here. <laughs> I mean, you yeah. You have to look at all of them. You looked at the last one first. It was the only yellow one, so. The Barnes Noble doesn't play this music anymore. I haven't been into Barnes Noble in a long time. Ours closed. Well, especially not yeah, this year, but. Oh didn't man, it, if they were having problems before, they would never have been able to stay yeah. open now. Didn't it close, but didn't they like move it closer to Woodfield? I think that was originally the plan, but I don't think they ever did. Oh. Whoopsies. They kind of wedged Link in this game. I mean, isn't it the Legend of <laughs> Zelda? That's right, Tarks. Oh Good point. Checkmate, Ryan. You know, the, <laughs> the only Legend of Zelda game where there is an actual legend of Zelda is Breath of the Wild. Hmm. That's not true. That's not true. End of Gamelon. The Wand of Gamelon. <laughs> you this play as Zelda. Is not <laughs> <laughs> Legend of Zelda game. I did get that um I did get that uh fan made remaster, so uh, I, I have them. <laughs> available to play <laughs> perfect outside of my cdi emulator i have which is not great not maybe canon. they've updated it no i actually asked it miyamoto is. he's he's like yep it's canon <laughs> they paid the money i guess it's canon now <laughs> <laughs> um, is it even on a nintendo system no no it's on the Philips cdi yeah so <laughs> it's not canon <laughs> There's it never was been a Zelda an game agreement. Off. It Are was you... an agreement made by Nintendo and Philips. Are you saying that it is a non-canon Ganon? Is Ganon the actual last boss in that game? Yes. You, yeah. You throw a book at him. You throw a book at him. <laughs> it's. It's a yeah. No, I'm going with it. It's a non-canon Ganon. You thought about it though. Oh, Ganon's in <laughs> shit. <laughs> No. <laughs> I don't know. Even if it were Vatu, because Vatu's been in enough games that he's a major villain now. Vati? I've never heard of him. From the uh, Game Boy Advance ones? Whatever. Vati, Vatu. Okay. Um, He was the ben... last boss in... He was in a lot of the, like, the, like... Uh, he was in... The mobile games? Phantom... Yeah, the mobile ones. Phantom Hourglass... I think, no, I think there became like a demon train and a Ganon type of thing in Spirit Tracks. I never played Spirit Tracks. That's the only Zelda game I've never played. It's hard to find. I heard it is fine. I heard it was good too, yeah. Hyrule Warriors 1 is non-canon. Yeah, that is true. Technically, yeah. It's not. I mean, they cross... Link's crossbow training. And centuries and stories um <laughs> link's crossbow training i think is canon <laughs> i'm pretty sure <laughs> but i mean there's like nothing to that game <laughs> we're on the timeline is it, <laughs> is it before <laughs> it's, it's after go and get your book ocarina yeah, of time <laughs> okay which well which which split because ocarina of time is the one that split it oh goodness pick one just, just they all have it in there somewhere. Yeah, it's just every timeline. <laughs> <laughs> Where does Link not have a bow and arrow? It's just wherever, whatever it's gets me out of this conversation. <laughs> um, the timeline is Smash Bros. Tarks. Um, it is not canon for Zelda. I love Smash Bros. I just love it that I could be Bowser and just womp Ridley or something, you know? Mm -hmm. Smash is just great. Super Smash Brothers is the the end game of Nintendo. Yes. 
I had to check. And I this have... Zelda, the one we just saw, is the Smash Ultimate Zelda. I like her design in this game. It's really cute. Yeah. It's cute. Um, my favorite design for Zelda out of all the games is Twilight Princess. Oh. Well, I have Phantom Hourglass, apparently. Oh, I want that. Yeah, you do. You said you were playing it. Phantom Hourglass? Yeah. No. Yeah, that's the pirate one. No, 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 I've never played it. But you just found out you have it? Yeah. She said you that they... Play it. It's good. She um she initially said that they never did um a pirate Zelda and then she's like wait yeah a that's what I was saying I'm like yeah. oh they never had a pirate Zelda and then I was informed oh, that that oh, is incorrect oh, wait, wait 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 get that weather vane it's a safe spot we I think this is another one of the games where the safe spot might tell you hey you've been playing for a while you should take a break yeah probably yeah. 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 Okay, I, I do like, have Link Between Worlds. I see that. Yeah, okay. I guess uh, the Smash would be the the culmination of the three timelines coming back and running into each other. I don't have enough money. Because I... Get to work. I tried to buy the, the bottle when I was testing, and it's 100. I think it's neat that Link now has two signature outfits due to Breath of the Wild. Oh, because of the champion tunic and no hat. It's like the new Link. He has no hat and a man bun. <laughs> <laughs> That's our Link. And everyone thinks he's hot. <laughs> he is. <laughs> <laughs> Which what one is this? Half the hero of time. The, the crazy one, the Breath of the Wild one. Out of all the links, he is the craziest. Oh, uh, yeah. That's fair. Okay. I mean, he's out there climbing mountains and shit. Oh, okay. Throwing weapons. I he's mean, if they're no good, then what's the point of keeping he's, it? He's certainly done the most. Sahasrahala. I never knew how to say this guy's name. I looked away. Name him Sean. Sahasrala. 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 Yeah. Sahasrala. Sahasrala. Yep. He looks Series like he wrong. would be in charge of like lightning or something. <laughs> he looks like he'd be really smart because he has a big head. I mean, maybe. <laughs> uh, Tarx is right. You can just go straight to Ganon if you try hard enough <laughs> in Breath of the yeah. Wild. It's just in your underwear. <laughs> and a stick. <laughs> it's pretty good. Hmm. I should probably go back to that game. Oh my god, I love Breath of the Wild. It's just, it's so I good. I recently opened it, and I have, out of the 999 um, Deku guys, I have 670-something? Mm -hmm. I think my problem was that I just opened up the maps, and I just kept crawling around the maps, and I didn't really care about the story. I I fucking love the reward you get for collecting all those Koroks. What is it's, it? It's so good. It's literally a pie. A you could call shit. it that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it is cow pie. It is a poop. It's a Korok oh. pie. It is a golden poop. <laughs> yep. Are you serious? It is a yep. yep. It is three, and so it looks like a Korok seed, but it's like, oh. you know how like soft serve ice cream, it's like bubbled like three? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Favorite. And it's like a three for Korok seed that's gold. And you find out that all these Korok seeds have been poop that you've been collecting. Uh. Been Korok poop. <laughs> I mean, that is reward. sure. It's good. Well, what's it for? 
No, I mean, it's just for doing it. You did it. No. Here's your poop. Yeah. That's it? Okay. <laughs> it, is the, it is so unrewarding at the end. That's why I was like, <laughs> 670 of them, and it took me like a half an hour to try to try, and I failed still to get one Korok because I had to get a boulder onto the top of a house using the telekinesis one where you hit it and it flies. Mm -hmm. And I was, and it took me a half an hour and I still couldn't do it. And I was like, I'm not, I'm not doing the rest of these. Yeah. I'm getting <laughs> 230 more of these when one of them is taking me a half an hour. Ugh. Yeah, that's a little too much. Legit represents the pointlessness of 100% achievements. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Having a little, uh, Listen, I, I I like to find reasons to play games more. Um, you learned how to play Mahjong. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> God. I'd like to learn how to play Mahjong, though. You know how to play Rummy? No. Okay. It's um, a lot. Not off the top of my head, but like... I know I've played 500 Rummy before, and I know when I hear the rules, I'd be like, oh, yeah, that's how I do it. Yeah, that yeah, it it's a lot like that. You have to make like sets and stuff like that. And but the the, the complicated thing is there's a billion sets. Mm -hmm. Um, And the point system is complicated as well. Uh, So I just kind of just kept kept playing until I a kind of learned it and then B won enough. Yeah. In uh, Yakuza 0. I mean, I think you get a really good reward in Breath of the Wild for getting all of the shrines. Um, yeah. And there's 120 of those, and they're not easy. Yeah, sorry, um, yeah I know what you mean, Tarks. <laughs> it, it's, like this, it's like this task where they're like, no, you probably shouldn't be doing this. Oh, wow, you really did it? Well, uh, here's this, I guess. Congrats. And you can wear that poop like a badge of honor. Yeah. I mean, yeah. When you get past, like, I think it's when you get past, like, a certain point, which is lower in how many of them there are. Like, you don't get any more weapon expansion slots. Like, that was the point of them. Mm hmm. Um, is, is to expand your slots. But you stop getting those after a while. Like, maybe 300? I don't know. Then it's just 600 to go. With no reward. Do I have to go back now and say hi? Yeah, go check out Ravio. Okay. Ah. He might have rearranged your house by now. Velio. I legitimately have not played this since 2013, so... Um, I remember beating it, like, over the course of, like, a week. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I I'm like, I remember... Didn't... Go ahead. No, no, I was just gonna say I don't. I remember playing it when I got it for Christmas, and yeah, it was like a week, week and a half, or whatever. Yeah, I beat it in like two or three settings. I was like, oh my god, this is awesome! Remember, I beat um, Azura's we... Mask very quickly too, when that came out in 3DS. Yep. Yeah. <gasps> right. I liked the mechanic in this game for items. Yeah, that was that's what was cool about this game that I like too is that it it there's no set path, so it was like a a mini Breath of the Wild in that aspect because they give yeah. you like all these items right away. Like you could what? Oh, I forgot that's about a tutorial. this. Yeah, you don't have. You don't have arrow, um, like, ammo for your arrows. It's mm -hmm. your meter there. And if you go back in, is, he, is the other stuff there yet? I'm, I wonder if we have to beat the dungeon no, first. Probably. So there is, like, a first one, and then after that, it's like... But then you could get all of it, and you could you could buy all the items, that, any item that you want, right at the beginning, or rent from him. Um... And then, but if you die, all of that goes away, mm -hmm. unless you buy them from him, which you can do. Yep. And then you can upgrade them with the Mai Mai's, which I don't know how to pronounce. It's M-A-I-A-M-A-I. 
Maya Mai? M A I A M A I. M A I A. Yep. M A I A. Maya Mai. Maya Mai. I just call him Maya Mai. That's fine. Too many A's in there. There's another Zelda game that we should probably take a look at at some point in our lavish streaming career. Um, hmm. the the ancient stone tablets. Oh yeah, you have that on the list. The BS. I don't know what those are. The BS no Zelda ones or whatever. The um. One that has, like, essentially, like, a radio playing along with you while you play. Oh. It's interesting. To say the least. What did that come out on? Super Nintendo. Uh, it was with the... Satellaview, I think it was called? Mm. Uh, it was an attachment that would link to a satellite and you could download stuff. Interesting. This dude! That's good. Good. I, I was worried Bowser would still be where he was because he seemed to be a little, uh... We went in the snow. Mm -hmm. He enjoyed it for a second, and then he was very slow, and I think he, I think he's his back is not doing well, so... Aw, poor baby. Mm-hmm. The weirdest I'm thing... Like on Satellaview. I will give him love. Yes. The weirdest thing Radical on the Satellaview was Radical Dreamer is the first sequel to Chrono Trigger. Hmm. See, Ryan? Um, there's a bevy of things that you'd be interested in in the Satellaview. Why not take a break? <laughs> Alright, it's break time, guys. Okay. Ah. <sighs> Alright. We'll be back after these messages. <laughs> after these messages, we'll be mm. right back. There, you remembered it more than I did. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the stream. Um, Tarks, I don't remember the lore behind Ravio and why he has everything. So we'll, that'll be fun to find out. Re, uh, find out again. Oh. Um. Doesn't this game have some sort of online component to it? This one? I don't think this one does. I don't recall. I think it was just the Street Pass thing. Oh, it yeah. did have Street Pass functionality. Yeah. Oh, and then couldn't you, like, you would give something to other Street Passers, and I remember I always wanted to give, like, the really good stuff, or maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Um, I've heard of Radical Dreamers. Um... I have never played it. I actually kind of watched a um, Let's Do Games Fast kind of stream of that, and they were um, speed running run. through speedrun of Chrono Trigger, Whoa. Radical Dreamers, and Chrono Cross. And I caught it when the people were finishing up Radical Dreamers and moving on to Chrono Cross. So I still really never saw much or any of it. Yeah, the, I think the because Satellaview... you don't get any story when it's uh, speedrun. I think the Satellaview games were pretty short because they were... downloaded. Onto that a makes sense. SNES cart. Which I don't Would have think... been temporary too, yeah? Yeah, I don't think there was a ton of RAM to play with. I mean, Chrono Cross also was very... Um... There was a lot. There's a lot of characters, a lot of characters you can miss, a lot of characters you'll... You won't get every character on your first run. It's a... Chrono Trigger, in my opinion, was a great standalone game. Like... I think you want to shoot the top one first and then the bottom? Or either. Either. Piss on that. Long as the wolf down. But Chrono Trigger did so well that that's why they probably made another game. I remember liking the look. Like, it just looks nice. This this is a nice looking 3DS game. Mm -hmm. 
The animation's really good and everything. Good job! Thank you. I'm pretty good at video games. Hi, I'm Joe, and I'm pretty good at video games. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> you're fine. <laughs> no, I'll take alright, that's fine. <laughs> pretty good. Pretty dang good. Pretty good. Hey! Ooh, Pretty see that secret good. door? I, I know do where see that, that secret, going. secret door. The Ryan Seacrest secret, door. Uh, secret door. Tricky, tricky. I like his footsteps. That's always one thing that. Oh, yeah, yeah. no, totally. Before. That's always one thing I, I listen to for like fun sound animations. And Ocarina of Time. Mario Sunshine started it. Ocarina of Time has some really good footsteps, especially in the Temple of Time. Mm. The feet on the marble, even though it was like it was, it was like two sounds, but it, it sounded like wow, he's he's walking on marble for sure. Really running on that marble? Damn. The immersion. He's really running on that marble. I said. You're stuck. Yep, that's the game. Oh, okay. <laughs> the end. And Link starved to death. You don't even have a shield. No, nah, should I? You I don't need not. a shield. I'm pretty sure that's a checkpoint that will take you back to the beginning. Or that some cool. random good thing you didn't listen to me. Oh no, it is the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember that. Um, yeah, there's like big the, things. The, yeah, that's like a very mobile Zelda mid-boss temple thing. I do remember those. Woo! Ah! Can I go that way? Okay. Nice. One day we will get our playthrough of. Nice. Oh, uh, you get a ton of these. Um. Uh, we will get our playthrough of, um, Four Swords going. One day. One day. And we can all say we've played it, and we can put it on our ranking of Zeldas. Big door. Magic. Ooh, it's just an elevator now. Do I have a key? I don't have a key. Um. I like that trumpet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> just belting out that s sweet tune. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's his solo, or yeah. their solo. That's definitely not that. Hmm. Oh. Weird. Maybe the, the effects of height would be better if we were in 3D. It, yep, I better turn it on. One sec. Don't you just have to slide the... Yeah, that's what I'm looking for over here. One sec. <laughs> so, on a 3DS, because all you have to do is slide that slider. What does mm -hmm. that do? Like, does that make things... How does that work? It always amazed me that I could see 3D without glasses on a mm -hmm. video game. Uh, it's very cool, right? Um... Uh, hold on. Can I glyph? I don't want to do this. I don't want to mess anything up. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I was going to do it for the gag, but then I'm like, these are a lot of options here. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think it's something with, like, interlaced video, essentially. I know, but how does it trick your eye? Because it does mess with your eye all. I think it's like... like 
two, essentially two screens pointed in slightly different directions, so your eyes would catch the two. I think. I could be wrong. I could. I'd, I think that might that might be a really dumb way to put it. The screen I had slits. I just thought it was the coolest thing. I was like, this is amazing. Yeah, glasses. Yeah. That's why I. Glasses free it. 3D is the best way to do 3D and like the only real functional way to do 3D nowadays. Mm -hmm. um, now, if they can make it so you can stare, you can see it from like more than just head on. Like if you could see it from an angle, mm -hmm. I if think they, they can, can perfect that. That's I think, cool. I think they made some TVs like that. But like 3D, I want a 3D switch. 3D is no longer a thing anymore, though. I know. I, like I hope it comes back. I like the little fart sound it makes. Oh, that when you hit him? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need a key to open that? Nope, okay. That is the big key. Mm -hmm. I thought in... That's only... Chat, maybe chat would know... I feel like in Link to the Past, you had to have the big key to open the big chest. You did. You did. Okay. And it was... I hated it. It was I, so annoying. It's I, like... Like, I found like, the fucking chest. <laughs> yeah. And a lot of times you would. You would come past the chest before you'd find the big key. Oops. Uh, Tarks, I agree. I'm, I'm glad the 3D fad kind of stopped. I know, Ryan, you like it, but... Eh. There were times it was really nice and impressive. Um, I remember uh, Mario 3D Land. I feel was... like games are the only acceptable thing. I saw Jurassic Park with 3D, and it was pretty good. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you could oh. probably do it pretty good, like pretty well in like a game or a movie but it you have to make it not gimmicky and that's the hard part we took our 90 year old grandmother to see star trek in the theaters in 3d and about two-thirds through the movie she asked me she leans over and she goes is this in space i'm like oh. <laughs> yeah graham yeah it's in space yeah. <laughs> She Aww. stayed through the whole thing she had 3d glasses on over her other glasses i was mm -hmm. like because we asked her, do you want to go to the movies? The whole family was gone, and she was like, mm -hmm. yeah. I was like, oh. I think we were all surprised. I just wanted to go out. Yeah, we'll shoot you. just wanted to be with the family. Yeah. This guy's easy. I need my juice, though. You're going to spoil everything! Cool mechanic. Mm -hmm. I like it. They really could have just ran with this, just did like a whole nother top down Zelda. A single tier rolls down. <laughs> um, they really could have just done another top down Zelda just in this style and gotten away with a heck of a great game, but. They added this mechanic, which is pretty dope. I feel like I like this one the most because it was the most puzzly. Well, not the most, but I think I really enjoyed it because it was puzzly with the mm -hmm. 
the wall. All that shit. All about perspective. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and it depends on which way you go. Oh, and, and your Ravio meter shrinks, too. Mm-hmm. Oh, I wasn't even noticing that. What if we go the other way? Like, damn, this game is more than just the top-down shit. It's cool. Ah, Ravio juice. Delicious. <laughs> Ravio goo. Ugh. <laughs> that might be a little too much. I know what I said. I'm just saying that might be a little too much. It's like... It's like ragu, Katie. Ugh. <laughs> Ragu's chunky. Not yeah, well. There's a really good tomato basil ragu. Yeah, but you still get chunk... Like, not chunk chunks, but you still get that... Texture. I get some texture with the with the ravio goo as well. <laughs> wow. Yeah. wow. I'm, I'm glad they took away um, wallet limits in Zelda's. I don't yeah. like finding like bigger wallets and stuff like that. They've done a good job refining Zelda games to a point where it's like Ooh, modern. Oh wait a minute, what am I doing? <laughs> Unfortunately, oh, no. they added stamina, which was a downer for Skyward Sword. The yeah, it I think for that Breath was the where it was because you worse had to have it really. I don't know much about that one either. Skyward, Skyward Sword. Sword. Uh, Sword. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, like I started watching an LP, and I think. I don't remember if I said this before, but I know I was watching it, and they got decently into the game, but then their save got corrupted. And... Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I was Maybe watching... That's a hard game to start over, too. I yeah. was watching uh, Counting Nightmare. Do it. Oh, did she do it? Yeah. Um, oh, okay. She 100%s all our games, too, so, like, you you yeah. see that game. <laughs> uh, For better and for worse. Whether you want to or not. Mm, that's a... <laughs> Ugh, that's a bad that's a rough one to hundred percent mm -hmm. like there's no Korok seeds or anything but there's a lot of stuff mm -hmm. I remember the flying being okay especially for motion control flying that was like okay but it was more just the the dungeon design and stuff like that and and there were some times where you would have to fly and it was timed because mm -hmm. like the pumpkin soup was oh yeah to be hot upon delivery or things like that, and yeah, the bug catching. I think the bug mechanic. catching. And like, yeah, yeah, to get like a um, gratitude point. Yeah, you got gratitude points from people um, if you did good deeds for them, and then you got rewarded on Skyloft by one guy for the gratitude. Points. Mm. What's the cold soup gazpacho? Mm -hmm. What was a pumpkin gazpacho? Well. Pumpkin soup just sounds gross in the first place. Oh no, pumpkin soup's good. Really? Yeah. I mean, you spice it. You don't leave it plain pumpkin. It's not like, it like a pumpkin a pie. Creamy soup? Yeah. 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 Oh no! Listen well, beef dip. It's like pureed pumpkin. It's time to dip your beef, if you know what I mean. Into adventure, oh. of course. <laughs> into adventure. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine pumpkin soup tastes like squash soup, which is amazing. Yeah, but I, I, I swear mm -hmm. I've had a pumpkin soup. Or something, maybe it was like a pumpkin dip that was like... Pumpkin I don't know. It was, it was very good. I remember it being very good. Like, it was a little spicy, but you still get a little bit of the pumpkin sweetness. Can't be you're wearing. That's the pendant of courage. Sonic the Hedgehog will be here soon. Wait, where did you get that? Oh, I just found it. Oh, we got it from Zelda. Zelda, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just found it.
This is a great sound effect to talk over, my friend. I know. Wee wee. <laughs> Can we go somewhere else? What? <laughs> huh? Now you officially got it. That's right. <laughs> oh, I meant to uh, shout out your friend, uh, Katie. Sunny Delight. Delight. Yeah. So for who? the for the 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 uh, the follow and subscribe. Yeah. During, during Steve's uh, mallow run yesterday. I wasn't even streaming. That's how that's how good of a channel we are. It was cool because you still got the announcement. Yep. Yeah. I think that's just because Joe had his audio. <laughs> I just had OBS still open, so the browser yeah. played. And I gotta be able to do sound effects. I mean, we know you. One day, Ryan, during a D&D &D session, I will... I'm gonna slip in a sound effect and see if he notices. He will. He won't <laughs> like it. No, I'll just... <laughs> Please do the scream. I'll just do oh the... Oh my god. And or that. Like... <laughs> yeah. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> I want the di guy dying. <laughs> yes, thank you. Sorry, I had a cough. <laughs> <laughs> that is from the movie Heavy Metal. Heavy Metal. I always think of that, about that now. It is a crazy animated movie done by several different animators because they were on a time crunch in the 80s. It is a very good movie, probably if you're high. Hey. <laughs> what are those movies? Yeah, it, it is. <laughs> it's so out there. Hey, 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 hey. Ooh, hey, hey. But it's got that screen. Mm-hmm. It's a good scream. It's a very good scream. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think the Sonic Hay would work. Um, that's probably it. <laughs> so I can convince him that I that I did this. Well, I, I'm I'm afraid to click this on there, but there we go. <laughs> <laughs> I did not read that because I was making sure that everything was okay. What happened? Go to the swamp. Mm, sure. I see an X on my map. I will go to it. Yeah, I mean, that's usually where they want you to go. I've played a video game or two before. X marks the spot. Yeah, you have to go to the swamp or the Tower of Hera. You could probably go visit Ravio again. I was just there. Oh. Go visit him again. And he was like... I want all the stuff. He's like, piss off, twit. Or kiss oh, off, so twit. <laughs> Ravio wouldn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't sound like the Ravio I know. Ryan, have you ever played Shenmue? <laughs> no. Okay. I don't know that we ever should, but... <laughs> it would be fun, actually. It'd be really interesting. It would be interesting. It's an interesting game. Interesting. You see, like, in what way? In, like, Life Simulator. <laughs> it was kind of mind-blowing at the time. Like, for sure. Oh, yeah. For sure. Yakuza refined what Shenmue was trying to do, I think, in a way to make the games f like that fun. Oh, yeah. I don't know why I'm going that way. Because I can. The world is my oyster now. why not? Ah. Like, like! Eat it. <laughs> it's a flan, so I guess so, right? Yeah. Take that. I can't hit these guys, right? Not uh, not ones. yet. You can shoot I mean, them? Like oh yeah, duh, you could shoot them. I mean, you can't physically go up to them and hit them unless you want to get them. shocked. Yeah. Is 
still don't have a shield either. Oops. You don't need a shield. You're right. Just take it with the front of your body. You're fine. That's kind of what I'm doing. <laughs> yep. And I'm assuming I need a... Yep. <laughs> I'm assuming I'm going to drown if I jump in here. <laughs> <laughs> I remember these crabs. And the bee. Katie, you know the death of Flash means the death of crab battle. Oh shit, you're right. Mm -hmm. Somebody Maybe. definitely uploaded that to YouTube, though. Well, it's on the Switch. <laughs> you're, 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 you're absolutely right, Ryan. It is you're on the right. Switch. So it's all, it's saved. We can live a crab battle each day of our lives. I can. Ooh. Oh, I forgot. You get like a big hammer too, don't you? Yeah, you get some fun items in this, um, this one. Wow. How I'm... much is it supposed to snow, by the way? Five inches. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, it was definitely already at seemed like it was already at five inches when I went out to take Bowser out. Oh, really? Yeah, it it was quite a bit of snow already out there, which I'm okay with, because I've been hoping for some snow lately, but... Yeah, there hasn't been much at all. We had, like, a, a measurable snow in October, and then it was, like, 80 the next week. And then um... nothing. You can get a shield from Kakariko. Oh, I'll go do that. Ow. Thanks for the nudge. And while you're in Kakariko, you should go into the house that has a big bee on top. Ah, uh, now you lost me. Ah, oh, yeah, the bee hut. The bee hut. Have you like seen Sunlight? Sunlight. <laughs> like Cully's the, gone. Last is what, except it's not. It's our bees. Uh... <laughs> our bees is expensive. It is. Also, beef. like D tier fast food. I said it. B tier or D tier? D as in dog. I don't know about that. Arby's? It's pretty good. Their chicken is actually pretty good. The chicken sandwiches. I like curly fries, and they have jalapeno poppers, so... Yeah, they're curly fries. And they're Arby's sauce, whatever it is. Between. Mm -hmm. See, Joe, you're just gonna be outnumbered. Arby's. I, if I, if I want to get Ryan on my side, I know how to do it with fast food, so don't even test me. I'm not trying to get anyone <laughs> on your side. <laughs> I'm just saying, it ain't that bad. I ha to be fair, I have not been in a, to an Arby's in a long time, so. I mean, there's not many around anymore out here. So. Yeah, well. I used to go there on Saturdays when I had work on Saturdays. There was about one by the collection center we worked at, right? That's yeah. what I'm talking about. When I had to work there on Saturdays, I would go to lunch at Arby's, pick up stuff, head back, and enjoy the fries because they were delicious. It's the rock house. The rock house? It had a rock on top of it, so I figured this was the rock house. Oh, neat. Hey! Oh! It's a Korok! Oh, cute. I liked the two uh, companions in Wind Waker a lot. Medley and the little guy. The, yeah. I'm still disappointed that they turned into Korox and not Kiku. Why are you disappointed? Huh? Why are you disappointed? Because they 
had the characters turn into car accidents. Oh, I see what you're saying. Now they're all just Koroks, and I'm like, okay, well, that's not bad, but they're not taking them. Sikus are dead! I mean, I assume that they are. No one's ever said anything else as to where they went. They just disappeared. Now there's a new race of plant people. I don't know. Or they turned into stall children or something. Stall children oh, sound like the, uh, <laughs> the children who grew up in bathroom stalls. Whoops! You shot it! I did. Good shot. Thank you. I didn't even mean to. <laughs> <laughs> I meant to um, do that. That building that you're at. Yeah. Oh, the one with the shield on it. Is this where you can find a <laughs> shield? Is that the shield place? <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, I see. She looks crazy. Oh, you're interested? Sure. Thank you. Watch yourself out there. Sure. I will buy a foul fruit. I also buy this onion. Oh. A scoot fruit! Oh, that's nice. The onion is the foul fruit. All right. Yay! It's called, it's called the shield shuffle. Loses about three hours in your playthrough, but looks right as hell. It loses about three hours, or no, it loses hours. about three hours. So. If, if you're if ever... you're going for a speed run, it would add three hours to the joke. <laughs> um, if you ever find a golden bee, make sure to catch it and bring that to the bee guy. Um, because then you'll get, then you'll be invincible from bees. Oh, it's just randomly um, if you go in nature. North of, yeah, everywhere in life. Wait, do we have a net? Do you have to catch him with a? My bare yeah, hands. Yeah, we got the, oh, okay. the net from the bee guy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, if you go north of Kakariko, you could go to the fortune teller and she'll give you something. I think bear hand. Is that our bottle? <laughs> you don't remember the bear hand items we get? They're like no. Hulk hand, just bears. Don't sure. I'm sorry, hold on, did that? Uh, I guess I'll take a look out there. Oh, hell yeah. This is like the Metal Gear Solid 5 thing where you look ridiculous, but it helps you. Mm -hmm. Like the chicken hat. Or was this like the Street Pass Act? Did this have something to do with Street Pass? Maybe I don't know. Yeah, I don't think I ever really, or you will probably never really use the hint glasses. But that's a really go. unfortunate fortune teller logo. I always thought it was like a ball, and it had like wings on the side, but it looks like a guy's like touching the ball. Certainly does. That's that. That's... It certainly does. Uh, okay. Uh, where are we going next? <laughs> judgment at the oh. logo. <laughs> yeah. I think judgment at Joe's imagination. That's not imagination. That's just an observation. Whatever. Observation. If I see two hands tearing open a circle. I'm going to think it's, it's impossible. It's been... It was scarred on my mind. Hi, Irene. I really have a witch girl. Uh oh. I don't remember what her point is. 
Does she just give you magic stuff? I got a bell. Uh, I think she... Uh, she's my quick travel. Yeah, she's your fast travel. Oh, okay, okay. To any of the... Chickadees, I've opened up the weather mains. Cool. Well, I guess I'll try to go up in the mountain since it seemed like I couldn't really do much in the... Unless I need to go get an item from... Ravio. Uh, no, you don't. Okay. Um, yeah, the mountains would be... A good idea. Um, it's to the... Left? West side of the mountains that you get up. Okay. Hey, buddy. What if I do this? The east side is the... Uh... Oh. What do you call it? Waterfall, I think, on the east side. Yeah, with the um, Zora. Yep. Mm -hmm. Does this share a map with um, four swords? Uh, sort of. Four swords... Yeah, I think overall, yes. I could be wrong. I'm actually so I think just I'm... remember you have to go east and then you have to go to you'll get to the Zora there too. I actually think I am wrong. Hello, Rosso. Do you sell rocks? The Goron wannabe. <laughs> I mean look at him. His belt even has a Goron symbol on it. Racks everywhere. Racks. Oh, people are just giving me shit. This is great. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Hey, here we go. Because it's not so much about getting items in dungeons anymore, which is a neat take. Damn. Um, now would be a good time to go check out Ravio, actually. You could check out your blacksmith friend. Father? And is he your father? He's no. Gully's father. Oh. I think. He's just our buddy. He's our surrogate father. Mm. Oh, okay. Like, papa. <laughs> The one at the beginning of a uh, uh, link to the past is his uncle, right? Yeah, the one who beefs who it dies. right at the front. Oh wait, yeah. go left. Beefs it right at the end. <laughs> <laughs> he hardly gets anywhere, and he's already like, "Oh, I'm dead." Uh, he fell down the hole, and he just ah, my ankle. Um. Oh yeah. So that is a. I don't know what's going on with his face. Maybe it's a goatee, but you can't see too much under mm. him where his chin is. No, I think that's, um... It's... Yeah, I think he's got... It's just that he's got a big space for his mouth. That he never opens. Mm-hmm. It's like a chin and... strap, but he's also got the mustache attachment. Oh. It's um, really bad. Go to the left of the house, merge into the wall, and go behind. Magic! Holy shit. Yay! Alright, now let's go see how you're to Ravio. Ravio! Ravio! It's the biggest stash ever that goes under his chin. <laughs> Ed. Yeah, we'll save. I feel like it is. I mean, it could be. It just 
plasters itself on his face or the sides of his face is all. Shut up, bird. I just got a, a text uh, asking if Luke and Leia banged. What? Yeah. They kissed? But no, they didn't bang. Yeah, that's... No. Who asked that? The hell? Don't worry about it. That's it. What? I think we go up the mountain, don't we? Yeah. Eat shit. Mm. The hell? What's up, Ryan? He should be ready to go. Should he? Are we doing, um... Do we have to do another well, dungeon you, first? You could clean up Rosso's place and pick up all the rocks and throw them so they're all clean and there's no more rocks in his yard and he'll give you rupees. Rupees? <laughs> rupees! Like you don't have... How, how many? You already have like 800. 600. I didn't see... You mean just outside? What? Saving the world, huh? Mm hmm Yep. Because you need the hammer for that. Yeah. Saving the world one rock at a time. So did you think I needed to go get a new item from from Ravio? I'm pretty certain you do. Sure. This will surely unlock Ravio. Okay. Yay! <laughs> Rob is all like purple. I'm there. Here's some more maybe, items. Maybe call the witch oh, or wait, something. Go in here. Oh, maybe yeah. What's the move? These fuckers. That, um, that Metroid run was really fun. I would, I might just do one of those soon again. Which, the randomizer? The randomizer with Link to the Past. Mm -hmm. I thought you meant other M, I was like, what? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> no. That was fun, but we had a, we had to look shit up for that. Yeah, we did. Uh, I, I would probably do it on slightly easier, where I would be guaranteed to get the morph ball right away. <laughs> mm. I think I did not check that. Okay, fine. I, I think you can pick those guys up when they turn um, rock. And then you could throw them and they die. Just leave them alone, it's fine. <laughs> they're not doing anything. It's true, they're not. They're just they're like running around in ball. random directions up here. They're like Charmanders. But spiky. Charmander. Okay, it's like Donkey Kong. Uh, okay, you turned watery again. Aww. You're back. Oh. Who you? Cha cha cha! I laid down for like three seconds. 
I wonder if, well, because now you're back doing it, I wonder if it's the way that I share my audio. Okay, okay. Because it's like, no, there's sound coming from mine. We're going to turn you into a water woman. It's just lower quality. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, cause last time it was, there was a lot of, like, loud noise in the background. Mm -hmm. so I think I just pop out over there for that other one. Probably. Probably. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's just okay. It's very, I don't know, there's something super satisfying about swinging the sword in this game. It feels good. It's got a large swing arc mm -hmm. as well. I don't remember, well, I barely remember the early portion, well, most of this game, to be fair, but, um, uh, I definitely don't remember, hey, really? Oh. Um, any of this, I, I do not remember any of this. I remember this part, I don't. Ah. I don't think it's, like, super difficult when I remember the caves. You do remember some, uh, Super difficult ones? No, no, no. I didn't think this was super difficult, like this area, but I do remember going in the caves and. Hmm. Oh, yeah, when you go into the wall and the music kind of turns into like a faded music. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. Sure. Okay, so now that we've seen this other icon, do you think it's... Yeah, I bet that's it. That you had to, like, see it and be like, oh, get all the way here and be like, oh, I yeah. can't do anything. Yeah, and they gave me a... Uh, they gave me a weather vane there. Yeah, which you could just come right back to then. Um... Use the bell. Oh, the bell. <laughs> the witch girl's cute. That's a cute little thing. Hey, wait, what's this all about? I just mowed earlier. All right. Yeah, Ravio took over. What have you done? That'll be fixed. I think that's how uh, me and Ryan became friends was I was playing with dinosaurs and he's like, hey, you wash my ears, I'll wash yours. That is. You had dinosaurs. <laughs> Katie was doing acrobatics with my brother, Greg. And the rest is history. Ta -da. I thought you guys had tumbling mm -mm. and I knew Greg from kindergarten. Hmm. You, you would probably know where you know Craig more than I do. I thought it was stumbling for you guys. Um, definitely wasn't us because Joe had dinosaurs, so. 
Well, I mean, you met in tumbling, but then you also played with dinosaurs as well. That's not Maybe. how. That's not how uh, mom tells it. I don't know how mom tells it. Mom tells our version. Mm. I will ask. Can I? Who had uh, tumbling, mom? <laughs> <laughs> who who was really tumbling, mother? <laughs> so now you can get all the items if you want. Um, and now the game super opens up to everything. You really want bombs too. Hmm. I said no. It's like oh. he flicked you off as he left. Get out of oh, oh. here. When we took the hammer, get out of here. Yeah. Both hands. Uh-huh. Just such a it's such a good way to handle this. Items and stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. I feel like it's a nice, like, way from, like, mobile-wise, like, you're not too constrained in one part. Mm hmm So, like, if you do get stuck, you have other routes you can go to right at the beginning. Um, I'm gonna go here, because this is where we saw the... this. That is pretty good. With the goo. This game's cool. Do something similar in that other one that we played. Hmm. Which one? Another Zelda? Yeah. Which was the Huggy Man one? That was the, uh, the Link to the Past. Uh, Link to the Past, yeah. The randomizer. yeah. Wasn't there something like that in this where you could only do like a certain color or a certain path one way and then you had to hit something for another one yeah probably yeah, yeah. that sounds like the ice the ice one yeah okay yeah yeah, yeah. am i a fool I'm trying to do anything else oh wait i'm a fool <laughs> It's gotta think differently, Katie. I mean, I played this game. So I obviously did at some point. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. They ever bring back the Pokemon? They might. <laughs> they might be in here. Not this. This specific dungeon, but they are definitely oh. in um uh what do you call it? Four swords. Oh. Uh, what is the huggy man? Oh. <laughs> Link in the sands of time. It's just huggy man all the time. <laughs> Huh. Oh, good idea. Huh. He'll never get out of this one. <laughs> <laughs> Joe's stuck now. <laughs> oh. I mean, you could always shoot an arrow at him. Yeah, I guess switch items. Hell yeah, I did. Anything else in here?
Hmm. Minish Cap is one of the 2D Zeldas that I just never got around to playing. I even got it. I even got it free on the 3DS because I was part of the ambassador program. When oh I, yeah. When they just gave a bunch of uh, games because they were <laughs> there wasn't a lot of games out early, so they're just like, here we feel bad. Minish Cap is real good. Uh. Oof. I'll just keep going, I guess. Wasn't it the Seasons one that came out on that, too? Um, that was Game Boy Color for the Oracle of Ages and the Oracle of Seasons. Yeah, didn't they have that on the Master thing, too? Mm-mm. They didn't do Game Boy, ga Game Boy no? like, regular Game Boy games. Huh? Oh, no? It's advanced? That was, uh, that was only until later. Or that was not until later. I'm sure you could find the <laughs> bloop, bloop, bloop. I'm sure you could find an ambassador list up there. Yeah. I could also just open my 3DS. Well, Ryan, chat says Minish Cap is very good. Maybe that should be on the list as a future Zelda title. To play through on here. Minish Cap used to be the first Zelda in the timeline until, um, what's it called came out? Sword. Skyward Sword. Yeah. Oh boy. I see. Hello. Wait, oh, is this where we- that's not where we start. No, okay, we're higher up. Mm-hmm. You're Good. way up on a- oh. You're way up on a mountaintop? On a tower on a mountaintop. <sighs> I wouldn't like the heights of this. Nope. Uh, the reason I ask is there's actually a, a temple similar in Minish Cap, if I remember from the playthrough that I did watch. So I would not be going in completely blind, but I do, I do not remember anything about that game besides said temple. Well, yeah. I've actually, I've never played that game. I don't have a guide for that game. No, it's just... Um... I just know that your hat talks to you. And it uses the sound bite of Link um, slashing from uh, Majora's Mask, and if you just slashed a lot, you're like, Well, there's nothing over here, which means there's something over here. Zelda's a pretty good series. Not a ton of missteps. The worst you could say about an actual, like, mainline Zelda game is like, eh. I guess it's just kind of boring. Mm-hmm. The Skyward Sword. And portions of Twilight Princess, let's be real. Twilight Princess gets takes a bit of time to get started. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah. I think the beginning of Twilight Princess is um the the roughest part of Twilight Princess. However, I think Twilight Princess has some of the best dungeon design. Oh, I love the um the ice dungeon in that one. Mm -hmm. I like the, uh... the sand dungeon in there is really cool too. Once you get the the spinner. Mm -hmm. I never got the, the arbiter. H never got the uh, HD version for the Wii U. Yeah, I don't think anything really special came out mm. in the 3D or the HD version, did it? I don't know. Um, no, it came with the pretty cool, um, uh, amiibo. That's about it, though. Fi is worse than Navi, for sure. Oh, Fi. 
Pi's annoying. Mm-hmm. Pi is rough. Okay, well, um... Minda's the best. I mean, Minda kind of steals the show in that one, so... It did look like Connect Good 4. Guess. <laughs> guess, I knew what I was doing. I knew it had to be on the left side. And I'm like, well, we were down here on that bottom portion. Have some faith, Ryan. Oh! No, what are you doing? Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> no! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> it's fine. You'll get it this time. The uh. worst part about Twilight Princess was the was one of the bad parts in um well oh, okay never mind um oh cool. was one of the bad parts in in Skyward Sword which was the collecting the tears I thought that kind of sucked the tears in Twilight Princess I felt like were like the beta and Skyward Sword I feel like they did it better <laughs> I can believe that. Like, they fixed what they didn't like from it's, Twilight. It's, uh, I think some people will disagree with me on that aspect. It's, it just, it still wasn't great. I don't know. In my opinion, I, I thought it was just like, uh, this is, I don't want to do this. <laughs> just let me go to the new dungeon. Like, I'm here. Let me in. Say, hey, look at all the I like that there. I would sing. The music was good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the and my usual go-to thing about games I don't really like that much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the music was, was good. Oh, cool. Oh, wow, you just creamed it. <laughs> Found like I, I can hold. Okay. These Octoroks? These aren't Octoroks. These aren't Actor Rex. So. <laughs> yeah, Actor Rex. At this part of Chicago? <laughs> you don't want to miss. Time of year. Speaking of small. Speaking of uh, Chicago, you know what I miss? Mm. I want some Super Dog. Mm. Yeah. Weep. Superdog is a hot dog place that uh, they give you your hot dog in like a little box full of fries. And uh, there's some good old fashioned Chicago style dogs. Go for it! I would say. Would you say they're better than Portillo's, Katie? They're mm -hmm. more authentic, I would say. Yeah. They're beefier. Well, they've got, um, like, the green tomato and everything mm, on it. Yeah. So I, I would say they're probably more authentic as well. Um, Though, the jumbo hot dogs at Portillo's are very good. They are very they good. Are. Um, Those are not Octoroks. They are called Hard Hat Beetles. Okay. Oh. So like the I used to call them bear helmet like the Chicago bear helmets. Um uh the beetles in uh Mario. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah I always yeah, thought they kind of looked like Chicago bear helmets. They don't. They kind of do. They're, they're black and they have a thing on it, I guess. <laughs> well, I mean they look like they're crawling around in a helmet, so yeah. it kind of makes sense. And I still blame, not blame, I attribute you, let's say, uh, to um, the reason I'm a Dolphins fan, Katie. Oh, yeah. It's a big burger. It is a big burger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. With little baby burgers. Oh. 
Ow. Good use of the sound effects from... Oh. From uh, Link to the Past. Mm -hmm. Wow, 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 wow. This is less scary than the uh, the Link to the Past fight. Right now, at least. God, he does look like a burger, though. I'm not just kidding. Oh, shit. It looks oh, shit. like a fucking burger. Ah! Stop ah! getting killed by a burger. Can't help it. Delicious. You eat them. What's this burger doing? He's stuck. He's stuck, yeah. Where are you going? I think he's still stuck. Oh, no, there Ooh. he goes. Now he's a steamy burger. Steamed hams. Steamed buns. Steamed bun. <laughs> Hot cross buns. Yeah. Fuck. Oh no! <laughs> it is you who shall be eaten by the burger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you lost all your stuff! I forgot about that. I should have grabbed a uh, a fairy from your house. Yeah, it was right below. Dang, yeah. I didn't even think about that. Here, I I'm think like, you've got a bee in there, though. I could just let it out. I should have let it out during that fight, actually. It could have hurt you, too, I think. Pretty sure it goes for the enemy. Uh, I don't know. I never really use bees. Yeah. Mm. Bees! Got a whole heart of damage. To go get a payday loan from the blacksmith. <laughs> My work just started doing direct pay. Uh, so you can get paid the day or for as much work that you've worked on that current paycheck. I guess it is kind of like a Souls like Zelda, isn't it? A little bit. Oh, I guess a little bit, yeah. If my I mean, it starts off that way. if my items were there or something, then then that would solidify it. But Ravio is the pale I doll. Mean... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Should I um? Okay, good. Yeah, I was Cause... gonna say there should be a warp thing. I am a doll. All right, is this the room with the? No. Unbelievable. I literally can't believe it. Whoa! <laughs> it's okay. Whoa! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I want this. Hey, hidden chest. Oh, Monster hell yeah. Monster guts. Ew, they're a handful. Just gonna slam me into that. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay, good. Eat shit. You got some guts. Oh no, what's Beetle Bailey gonna do now? <laughs> Stay stuck. <laughs> ah, well. Coins on the wall right down there. Single rupees. Yes, you're right. I could have got this single yeah. rupees. Yeah, two. Yeah, two. <laughs> <laughs> there. See, it, it attacks my enemies. Wait, wait, I need a nut. My nut. <laughs> I'm starting to swing my bottle. No! Come here, you little shit. Yay! Okay. Ta -da. There, I got most of my money Wee! back. And I'm stronger. Oop. <laughs> what was that, Ryan? Um, I just did a little I know, I know I wanted to hear it again. <laughs> oh. <Whoa! laughs> uh, 
Ryan, do you remember when uh, we would rent... So we would rent a couple games. Rampage, for one, for the N64. Mm -hmm. And then, do you remember, we would also rent Cruisin' uh, World. Yeah, it was one of the Cruisin' games because you got... And then Cruisin' World 2. So Cruisin' World had that stunt area. That was No, that was Rush 2049. Oh. That was that was super rad. That it had the stunt area that you can you had to get down to you like you had to go down a very treacherous hillside and not blow up from that to go into their stunt mode. And that was like the first one. And then the, I think Ten Rush 29 2049 had the actual stunt mode. Oh, that's right. You're right. But yeah, that's right. I I completely forgot about the stunt mode in a. I think that was just first San, Fr rush. San Francisco Rush. Yeah. It was like a hidden place. I don't know how we found it. I always reference San Francisco Rush, and nobody gets it whenever I say something like, Checkpoint! Checkpoint! <laughs> <laughs> that game was so much fun. And the explosions. It's dangerous! Spicy burger, no! You did a lot better that time. I just wanted to show what happens when you die. Uh huh. You see. Great fanfare. I would love to just keep doing that. <laughs> like it just never <laughs> comes to the to the end of it. Like the beat that never drops. I'm huge. Hey. I'm Link, and I'm large and in charge. Oh, I do remember they would, like, freak out if you haven't saved in a long time. Mm -hmm. It's time for a break. I mean, you just finished a whole day. I should change th this to say something else when it's break time. I am for a break. Ah. I am for a burger. You know time what I haven't for had a burger. a long time that I would like to have, even though it's awful for me? Kumas. Um, that is also true. Uh, but no, White Castle. Oh, hell yeah. Time for another splash of Bailey's? I could. I could. Huh? Hmm. I mean, you could have more. Nobody says you can only have one thing of Bailey's. That's true. Mm -hmm. What if I did this? Hold on one sec. I just hang up. <laughs> we'll be right, Bailey. Uh, let's see. Ray, pause. That was. Are you doing that thing? Hey. Hmm. Yeah, you are. Don't do that. Okay. Um, he I don't know what it. He did. Uh, get the tornado rod because he keeps saying it's on sale. I mean, I think you need the boomerang for the other one. Yeah. Is that boomerang? Yeah. Okay. I turned the uh, game audio down a little bit to see if that would help watery Katie. It's weird that it oh, only happens to you. It? Well, not anymore because I turned it down, I think. <laughs> oh. I did not was that loud. I turned it down for you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think stream is still... Uh, stream is still normal. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, 
Antonio. <laughs> oh, whoops. That's not what I wanted to hit. There we go. That's what I wanted to say. There you go. I already have one of these, I guess. I went to a black screen on OBS, so... Whoops. <laughs> you Fade go to black, the end. Up and east. Oop. And then down. Whoop and east. Whoop east down. Ryan, who is your favorite character? Let's say... Raiden doesn't count, and I know it's not Raiden, but just, just... And Sunny doesn't count. Who is your favorite character in Revengeance? Mm. Mm. Probably Samuel. Okay, yeah, yeah, good, good answer. Blade Wolf. Of course. I mean, why wouldn't it be a good? It's a good character. It's Blade Wolf's great. It's a good. No, the dog. No. Yeah. Oh. That looks like that's pointing at something. The hell you say? Hmm. I don't know if it was, honestly, but... It did look like it. <laughs> you you <Yeah>. were right. <laughs> Fart. Oh, don't you have to blow up something on the wall? Yeah, we could try that. Well, it well sh No, he's just gonna say whatever. It should make a... If you no, I meant on out. the other side. Nope, you can't. Okay. Oh, look, another shield shop. Weird. You... Oh, you know what? It might be there when you're in the other world. I can't tell if you're nudging me in a direction. Oh, look, another shield. Well, that's weird. <laughs> no, no, that one yeah. was just weird. I am yeah. nudging you to go to the right, though, and up a bit. Okay. and go into a cave that's it. There by a bomb. Okay. <laughs> Rented bombs! <coughs> I completely <coughs> forgot what the monster parts are for. Building a monster. Oh, I remember you. Okay. Why am I? Yeah, the shells. Yeah. She lost all of her kids. All 100 of her children Can't are do it. lost. Whoops. <laughs> I'll do it, sorry. <laughs> my, oh, my. I, th I think one of those shell kids are where you were just at. That's why I think... They might be. That might, might have been pointing to one that... Because if they're stuck on the wall, you go into the wall, merge, and then pop out behind them, and then yeah. they come out. That's right. And now that you have this, now all the Mai Mai's will be popping up everywhere. Yeah. Um, They are valuable to get. Maybe not all of them, but they're valuable to get because then you keep your... Um, Then she makes it so you keep your items. They are very cute. that's the thing of the Mai Mai. Yeah, and you hear this squeak, squeak. BBs. Take it. it to Mother Mai Mai, won't you? I don't know. I don't know what how many you need to get like her to give you something for it. What was the um, collectible in uh, Link's Awakening? Was it seashells? Oh my god! Yeah, seashells. I got forty nine of them, and I swear no, I went through the not. list of fifty twice. And I could not find the last one. I, I was so mad on the Switch version. Mm -hmm. I was so mad. I, I couldn't find the last seashell. And I'm like, I've been through this list of 50 twice and I have them all. And I was like, well, obviously I didn't. I was missing one. So I don't know <laughs> where. And I'm like, I'm not going through that list again. Yeah. Um, I don't think I can do anything. But I think in, in, no, no, my, my was the only thing I wanted you to get here. You could go wherever you want now. Go back down the area I was before. Take a look. A gander. I heard a cheap. Did you? 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, there. I can't. Mm, well, Pegasus boots. Or maybe. hammer? Or that? I don't know. Well, fuck you, I guess. <laughs> no, he hides. Aw. Ow. Go away. Ow. That's right, I have, I, wonder I have a shield now. <laughs> if you're going to need flippers to get to the next place. That's what we'll I was see. wondering. But they don't ha the they didn't have flippers at the store, did no, they? No, you don't. No, you get the flippers from the Zoras. The <laughs> Zoras. Ryan, what's a game that you would say you know... And then, uh, okay, both of you. Uh, what's a game that you would say you both know, like, the back of your hand? Like, you could just play it, get through it, possibly even 100%. Um... Any day of the week. Mm. Oh, I gotta go this way. Mm. Like, if you were to just jump back into, like, Ocarina of Time, would you know exactly where to go and all that? I would know the, where to go, I guess, yeah. Because I would say Mario RPG for me was one of them. Yeah, Mario RPG, because I played that off, like, a lot. Like, mm -hmm. I replayed it a lot. If not, it would be a Zelda game. Does Ace Attorney well. count? Sure. Yeah, it's a game. Yeah. I mean, I there's, there's play no, through that. There's no... Nothing wrong with any of these. You could say Super Mario Brothers. I don't know. Well, you said 100%, and I'm like, well... I said possibly 100%. Oh. Hey. Tweet, tweet. I think if you go in the witch's head, I think there's a Mai Mai in there. Or maybe it's in the cave that's just below you. I'm going to do know. this I real think, quick. I feel like there's a Mai Mai around here. Give it a sec. There's a Mai Mai somewhere. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. Get it. <laughs> I, now. I just wanted to do a safety save state. Yo. Yes, sir. Oh. Nice try. Like, like. Good. Oh, uh, it doesn't memorized... drop the coin? Ruby? I have memorized Bloodborne. No, I didn't. But you could probably, you knew a lot of it when we were playing it. I like, do you knew were, it. I did know a lot of it. You were able just to be like, no, no, you have to do this first and stuff like that. And I'm like, how the fuck are you supposed to know this? <laughs> yeah, she's, <laughs> or when we would pass a window and you're like, no, oh, no, no, talk to that. You, you can, it. you could talk to that window. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. What? I was like, how did you know? And you're like, the lights are on. Oh, I guess the oh, yeah. light's on, kind of. <laughs> I guess so, but... There's a lantern outside the door. That's how you know you're going to talk tiny, it. A tiny little lantern. And then you got to talk to the, this one, and you get... It's really patches, but it's not. But they give you a, a tonsil stone, and then you t go back, and it's a different person there. Yeah, that, that is your game for sure. you use the tonsil sure. stone, you mm -hmm. have to hold on to the tonsil stone <laughs> to yeah. go get picked up by Amigdal. That is absolutely your game. <laughs> Get it. Thank you. Ah! He's just oh. jumping with you. I don't think it was supposed to go there, but it did. <laughs> By the way, there's actually a, uh, a randomizer for um, regular NES Zelda. Regular. You know what I mean. Um, yeah. And Metroid. A combo of just the NES ones. Ah, oh, that's cool. Oof. NES Metroid is tough. <laughs> I love it, and I think I know I, nothing about that one. I think if I was a little older at the time it came out, I probably would have really enjoyed it. But it that one you you be you should be drawing maps for because you don't have one. You know how I useful mean, maps we are never really game. passed regular Zelda when we had it when we were younger. No, we did not. No. I have since. I mean, yeah. I have would you? assume that. Na I, no, I still, it's still not easy. Right? No, it's not. It's not. It's not yeah. easy. It's also hard to know where to go typically, but I think once you've done it, God, everything's just Pegasus boots for these 
losers. You can get the Pegasus boots now if you want. No, it's too late. <laughs> How do I get them? <laughs> Um, oh, you never might mind. have to go through the Zoras <laughs> first. Okay. How did I end up over here? Ah. You went through a cave. Oh, the cave by the witch's house. Okay. You could take the bell and take Irene back to the witch's house because there was a weather vein there. Zero Mission is a fantastic re-release of the OG Metroid. Oh yeah, for sure. That, I think, is on our list. What am I doing? Zero oh. mission? Yeah. If not, it should be. Because we we do need a palate cleanser after other M. <laughs> yeah, for, for, for Metroid. Metroid. Or Metroid. Well, Metroid Fusion's good, but... Yeah. Zero mission. I feel like that would just be a package deal. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Hey, buddy. Oh, there's the Zero. How does a Zora not know how to swim? Like, aren't they born in the Ooh, water? Ever heard of a fill in the box or whatever the name was? I mean, maybe he has a skin condition. Yeah, you never know. It's like a bird saying, I can't fly. I mean, there are plenty of birds that can't fly. It's like Link saying, I can't walk or something. <laughs> I don't know. It's, <laughs> I know what you're saying. I know what you did. Katie's just being contrarian. I'm just giving you shit. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> but consider this, Ryan. <laughs> but maybe he's got a skin condition. <laughs> I was giving it a backstory. You could... Hmm? Never mind. What's up, Ryan? I was going to say you could read those signs. Nah, <laughs> why would I? Down. Because he might say something like reading in video games. You, you know forget who you're talking to. Yeah, you Both need to... Joe now, and Steve do to not be, read in the video To be video fair, game. one of us was ready to go play through Yakuza Zero, and then the other was like, "Well, this isn't voice, so I'm not reading this." It's in Japanese, so I'm not reading it. Well, it's voiced in Japanese, but it's English. Definitely English translation. Here. Oh, there you are. Right there. You can't get it yet. It's ankle it's deep underwater. <laughs> <laughs> what if I were to just give you 500 bucks? Because <laughs> <laughs> you're in purple water, is why. That's a good yeah, sound effect. Yeah, it's pretty good. Making. Yeah. Oh no, she's choking. You idiots. I think they took her pancreas or something. <laughs> Watch choking. This. Good luck. Do, 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 do. Nothing here. Hmm. Okay. Now you gotta go get this boot gem. Guess where it is? That yeah, man's these, these crabs. No. Okay. No. <laughs> where could it be? Where, where, where I mean, could it be? I will <laughs> oh, okay, that's what I missed out on. I'm sorry I didn't read that, guys. <laughs> I mean, how would you know? <gasps> I thought that was gold. Oh. 
You're right. I, there's no other way for me to know. Hmm. Oh, wait. Go in the witch's hut. Oh, yeah. We didn't it's even... Or maybe. Didn't even do this. Is it in uh, no. Kakariko? Yeah. Okay. No. Mm. Oh. oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. There you go. Yeah, that's. that's there it is. Cool. There's baby. And these potions are actually. I remember using potions a bunch in this game. Yeah. I don't yeah. have. Um, I only have one bottle, but. Yeah. Good to know. Uh, I got my uh, Bones coffee shipment to, uh, the other day. Mm -hmm. I was able oh, to crack yeah. it open today. Mm -hmm. um, I got three flavors. I got uh, fruity cereal, okay. Irish cream, and salted caramel. Oh, the salted caramel is really good, and the Irish cream is pretty good. I would not recommend fruity cereal. <laughs> oh, you're not a fan. Hey, yeah, uh, fruity cereal doesn't sound like a flavor of coffee you would like. It smells it's like, like tricks. So, like, I yeah, I drink my coffee black, and it's mm, it's not. Yeah, great. it doesn't sound like fruity, fruity cereal sounds good for someone that drinks it with heavy cream and lots of sugar. Yeah, mm -hmm. I might I might try putting some sugar in it. Maybe that'll change my mind. Um, I also have some oat milk. Oh, um, you're on the east side of the castle. Go up that, uh, that side. This side. As if yeah. we were sneaking in. No. I said as if. We were. Strawberry oh. cheesecake is really good. Oh, that sounds good. My friends have in Hawaii have tried it. I had the uh, I had a cinnamon roll one that was pretty good too. Mm. That would be good. Was it more just a cinnamon flavor? Or did you feel like you tasted like the roll? Or it was a little or... sweet. Yeah, it was a little sweeter. But like like I, like I mentioned, I I drink my coffee black, so um, mm -hmm. I still felt like the cinnamon was a good. It was a good cinnamony sweetness, enough of one at least. Mm hmm. All right. Hey, buddy. At least you get you don't get chased out of town in this version. Good news. Good news. I have the rare stone. It's very smooth to the touch, if you know what I mean. Why don't you give it a rub? No. Yeah. Sure. Well. Oh, it's very smooth, isn't it? Yes, yes, quite. Uh oh. What's Bowser see out there? Probably somebody shoveling. Oh, probably. Yeah, it's 9:39. Maybe. Ah! <laughs> I'm just looking at the time. Thanks. Katie, you like uh, point-and-click adventures? Well, I guess Ryan yeah. does too. Um, Ryan, actually, I would, I'd be surprised if your brother didn't have it. Um, did you ever play any of the, uh, Indiana Jones ones? No. No? Katie? Have them? We did not um, have them. No, I bought it on Steam. Oh, you ha Oh, you do have them. Okay. Yeah, I have them. Or at least I have the Atlantis one. Um, because it was in a Lucas Arts game pack, I think. Um, I don't think I played it, though. Okay. Because I played, um, what do you call it? The Dig, which is one of the other ones that I played when yeah. I had that. Whatever. That computer I club that. thing you were in? Mm -hmm. At the um, library. Yeah. And I started Loom. Loom? And, okay. Yeah, you know Loom. Yeah, I know Loom. <laughs> Tell me about Loom. <laughs> or ask me about Loom. Yeah. Um, we should play Monkey Island. I forgot what the story or Because you have to learn a song like at the beginning of it. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. It's been like five years. 
Um, at least. Um, but I did play the dig. Uh, Recently, or just when I bought it. Okay. It, was, like, it first came out on Max and stuff, so it was a long time ago. I think there might have been more, a couple more in here. I can't remember a lot them. So I might actually have them. Because there's like, what, two or three of them? Mmm, yeah. And there's an N64 Indiana Jones game. Sure, throw it in. That's right, I'm no longer bloated. <laughs> I took my water pill. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade and then Indiana Jones and the Fates of Atlantis. Mm. Why don't they turn the Fates of Atlantis into a movie? Sorry, I'm watching Bowser make sure. Okay. Uh, they, well, they're doing another, in, one more Indiana Jones movie, I thought, so. Yeah, but now he's Mm-hmm. <laughs> Crusty. Do we get what's his face now? Probably. Side of beef. Right of, yeah, side of beef. Almost definitely. So you have the flippers, you could swim, which was our goal, but we wanted the Pegasus boots too. I believe you could get them from the thief. Oh, I know you get him from the thief. I think he's getting Kakariko, and you have to catch him. You have to, like, sneak up on him behind a wall to catch him. Okay. From what I remember. That makes sense. Ooh. Always nice. behind a waterfall. Whoops. This looks like a thing. I feel like at the base of one of these waterfalls, if you like go under, like you get a Mai Mai. It's like a really stupid Mai Mai. It's like, how is anyone supposed to find that? Maybe squeaks? Maybe. Well, it might you. not even be real, I feel like. Or it might be later. <laughs> oh. Yep. Well, there's one. Please don't attack me. I saved your queen. What are you doing? Yeah, why are they doing that? Well, we can probably, uh, what do you call it? I'm just go into the dungeon. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice shot, idiot. You loser! Maybe that's what he was aiming for. That's true, maybe he was protecting me. Oh. Ooh. Hmm. Ah! <laughs> Just crushed. Okay. Whoops. Well, I got. Let me see what I'm working with here. Okay. I don't think I can connect to those. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, alright. Oh, boy. How do you get here? Oh, this dude. Doesn't he just pop up in a couple other... Yep. I don't. I don't think I did these when I played. I don't know the treasure. Okay, that's good. Can oh, I get? Can just go? Yeah, okay. How do you get on top of it? Oh, maybe these. Really? Okay. Tricky, tricky. Oh boy. Yay! <laughs> great Fanta. Maybe you could go, oh, from the top of the stairs into the wall on the other side. Like this? Yeah. Oh. Well, I mean, we need rupees, so. That's the thing is, um, with this new system, rupees, like, gained their value back. Yeah. In a way that I, I feel like other games, not so much. Ed says he was looking up the lore difference between the blue elf Zora and the green dragon Zoras, and Wiki says the blue, the weird blue greenish monsters that stand up in Zelda 2 are also Zora. Oh. Yeah, I think uh, I knew that. Right? Ryan, I think. I think young Ryan would have loved Zelda 2, but I think you're past think the point. So. I think you're past the point of enjoying that game. <laughs> Maybe if you had like cheats. It has, um, Volvagia in it, which is a, a typo, and I think his name in the game is, like, Balthazar, something with a B. Mm -hmm. Um, but it, it, it's Volvagia. It's a giant fire snake dragon. Um, and they also, it's the first introduction of Dark Link. Yeah. Ah. Oh. It's a, it's a neat game, um. It's certainly better than Castlevania 2. Which had a similar... I don't want to say completely diff, uh, similar, but like... Where they kind of took things in a slightly different direction. Um, Castlevania 2 is a... It's a, it's a game. It's not a very good one. Doesn't sound like it. Mm -mm. There was um, there's a I think a puzzle in, in Castlevania two or or maybe it maybe it's a puzzle. Uh, and, well, I don't know if you can call it a puzzle, but uh, one of the things you need to do is you need to kneel down in a certain area for like a a couple seconds, and then that's what unlocks the thing. And there's and there's like no hint to this. I guess if it was your first Castlevania, then I could see liking it the most, Ed. Um, and it corrects me if I'm wrong about some of the obtuse puzzle solving in that game, but the music, the music fucking slaps, but... I mean, it's a Castlevania game. Barkerville. Well. You did it! There's probably a Mai Mai under that one back there. It's too late, Ryan. Yeah, it's gone now. <laughs> Look at you. You know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Resident Zelda expert. <laughs> Glork. Glork! Oh my god. <laughs> Glork 
for the internet and our viewers. Glork was my first username, I guess. You yeah, know? yeah. Uh, for first internet username that I used. It was for like this thing called Cybertown, which was super fun. It was cool it was for the time, okay. especially at the time to play a game in your browser like that. Mm -hmm. Ridiculous. Shockwave. That's gone now, probably. Yeah, because that was Shockwave. that was Shockwave, which is just kind um, of Flash. So, yeah. And my name was Glork. G L O R K. I have fond memories of your basement. And the computer there. And memories of your <laughs> base. <laughs> Despite, yeah, because that's where the computer was. And mm -hmm. Despite being scared to death of... Uh, uh, Phantasmagoria. Oh, yeah. We Remember. saw one death scene and you were like, this is not a game for me. <laughs> <laughs> I remember we came to pick you up, and you were playing like Wolfenstein, or somebody was playing Wolfenstein. I was. It might have been when he got the cheats for Wolfenstein, and then he just had this giant gun that melted people. Maybe that was a very gruesome game for the time. Yeah, I was like one of those things where I'm like, I know I'm gonna be scared of this, but I can't look away. <laughs> and then I fought with Dan. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Like, beat each other. No up. good. <laughs> yeah. We just like fucking, literally fucking fought. Fist fighting. <laughs> oh. My brother? Yes. No, they're not actually fist fighting, but. I mean, we did though. Did you? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, not like. You know, how kids fight, where they just kind of flail their arms around and shit, but, you know, we fought. Oh. <laughs> huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the way he showed he cared. I guess so. Uh-oh. Oh, I still have the lantern out shit. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. They wouldn't die if there was no way to kill them unless you had fairy dust, and then they think it's a fairy. Yeah. I think it's just a fairy dust. But those didn't have a skull in the center. They were just like all flames flying around. Hmm. Hmm. That was a heart. Um. I don't think so either. Hit my head on the ceiling. There was a lock door to the bottom, right? Oh, thank you, thank you. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 of course, of course. It's cool that they made it so item that you have to use to beat this dungeon is the one that you use to get in. Yeah, yeah. It's, um, I think item usage is, uh, well, I mean, it's obviously really important, but I think it's like, there's, like, a bit of an art to it. Um, you know what game does it really well? <clears throat> well, it, maybe not, maybe it's a, this is a different example, because it's not really, like, puzzle solving, but, um, I always felt like Doom 2016 always gave you a great opportunity to use the new weapon you got to, like, its fullest extent almost immediately. And the one example that I think of is when you get the BFG in Doom 2016, the next room you get into is like 50 super easy to kill guys that you just shoot and like kill them in one shot and that's you're like oh this is cool but um it's a good way to to let you learn the mechanic of the item that you're getting mm -hmm. 
trying to think of a game that does that poorly. Um, Metroid? Other? No, I don't know. Um, there are games where um, that isn't done well. Or like you get items and it's full of tutorials at the beginning and then it's like just too much of an information dump. Yeah. It's like I don't know what I'm doing. Let's go in here. Oh. Ooh. How well did I map my analog stick? Oh shit, he's on the... <laughs> I thought he was on the ground for some reason. <laughs> Whoa! Uh. Okay. How well did you map the analog set? Pretty well, it seems, actually. Yeah, it's fine. I love that Nicole now decides is the time to ask me about Star Wars. <laughs> well, what's the question? That was the, the Luke and Leia... Bang. That was the of first all the one. Things. Of all like, the things. No, they did not bang. She's not watching. She's just asking. What was was there another one? Uh I thought I saw something. And I have convinced her that Baby Yoda's name is Glup Shido. <laughs> it's Grogu. <laughs> now, Glup you find out in this Glup Shido. <laughs> You find out this season what his name is. It's Grogu. I haven't watched it yet. There are no spoilers. You'll probably forget the name anyway. Yeah, it's kind of a bad name. Yeah, it's not Yoda. <laughs> but in my fanfic, Fifty Shades of the Force. <laughs> Fifty and Shades of the Force? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's already out there. Oh, at uh, 100%. Oh, okay. I have the arrow equipped. Here we go. Video games. I've You're played good at him. I've played a few. In my day. We were, like I said, we were... Um, in another conversation we were having earlier, or maybe this was yesterday, uh, we've... On this channel, we have beaten, like, 40 games. <laughs> If you include yeah. a lot of those smaller ones, but even if you don't, it's like 20-something games that we've gone through. Oh, Tornado right here. Or maybe I'll have to... I don't know, it doesn't look like I mean, it. To be fair, you've also done at least two 24-hour streams in between then and there. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Uh, maybe if you had the hook think, shot. <laughs> I think if I just drop down, I can get to a... Maybe if you had the hook shot, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's a, some way. It's impossible. There's no other way. Boomerang, actually. Game is over. You'll never win. Mm -hmm. It's all flocked. Yep. Good job. Yeah, well. We knew this was possible. You did it. Luke spent the night in the noble steed that found him. How is he going to get back to his town? That's a tauntaun. The tauntaun. It's not a steed. It's not a, it was noble, though. You have to. It was noble. The, poor, the noble the, tauntaun. The poor thing. Yeah. He killed it so he Whoop. could survive. How he's getting back to town in the morning? Who the fuck knows? Who knows? <laughs> That's the story for another time. <laughs> He'll figure it out. I mean, he had he to kill it to. to survive the night, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Oh. His buddies are probably like, oh no, he's not back yet. We better go look for him. That's exactly what happened. Yep. See? It makes sense. <laughs> oh, man. And I thought they smelled noble on the outside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, that's Grunt Fodder's show. I'm not taking... I'll steal Katie's jokes on a on on a day to day basis, but I mean we steal yours. Not my viewers. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. They're more work. Everybody's workshopping jokes is the thing. Yeah. That's what I was trying to do. Ooh. Yeah, I knew you'd like that. 
Mm -hmm. That was a good one. Ryan's gonna be so proud of this attack. I don't think I can go that way. Mm. Not yet. Feels like you should be able to. Nope, soft locked. I, I want you to be able to. <laughs> nope, <laughs> soft locked. You scared it. Bonk. <laughs> <laughs> With your head. No. Hey, there you go. There we go. I like. Now you could go this way. I like Zelda and... dungeons that um, take you outside. Yeah. This one does it a lot. It's cool. Or... Worms. Yeah, what are those called? Worms with a U. Blob. <laughs> Worms with a U. <laughs> Worms with a Y. Worms. Worm. W Y U R M S. W. Yeah, worms. Okay. But it <gasps> showed me. Katie. Hmm. You'll be happy to know there are huggy men in this game. Yes. Yeah. I'd... Oh, Their real not. name? I will not tell you. Because <laughs> they're huggy men. Yeah, they're huggy men. The real name just is dumb too. That's fine. Oh shit. Um. Oh, the worms are called Popos. That's a good name. Worms. Hmm. Oh, okay. So I have the big key, but I need one more other key. Okay. Oh, wait. You can look on your map. I need to get across yeah. there. Clever level design. Just a neat game. Okay. <laughs> this room still isn't, like, activated. Hmm. Can you go down those stairs and across that to the, to the left? So down the stairs? Uh... Down the stairs. Yeah. And then on that wall to your right, and then over the pit. Did you go there? Mm, and there's a lamp. Uh, boo urns. Now we could not. No, we. We're not. not nope. And then this I can't go through. To go that way. Unless there's a mechanism somewhere that flips these. Wait a minute. No, okay. Hmm. I mean, there's. Whoops. Like, more to this temple, isn't there? Like, the outside. Outside, we kind of hit a wall, and then I'm going to go back down. Okay. Okay, well, that's... Oh, these things. Whoops. Yeah. Okay. Looks like there is a chest on this floor. You're heading towards it. Oh, it's in the corner over here. 
One thing I do wish I could do is look. Like, first person. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think that would be helpful to uh, figure out what can what I can do. Um, that's gonna go there. Is there a way to get up? Oh, we might have to go up and around, actually. Because I want to get... Oh, wait, we might be able to do it here. I think the opening closed. Bah. Unless you can do it from the other side and go around. Mm. I guess not. We want to get up there. Mm. That one. Which means we just need to get back up on the top floor here. Which, can I just do this? Yes, I can. Yeah. Oh, all the way. Nice. Mm. Oh, I just fall down. We did this, so. There we go. Key, key, key. Oh. <laughs> Yay! I mean, that's very valuable, but not what I need. Not what you need. Not what we need. We. Huh. Okay. So, um, there's nothing left on this floor. That doesn't mean there's nothing left valuable on this floor. Like, maybe there's a passage up. Oh. Go in that door to your left. I can't. Can you get to that one? No, that's the, the that's where I need to go, because I need to get through here. This path down there, but that wind blows me. Yeah. Oh, just out the wind. What about that button? Same, th same issue. I can't get there, because... That's on this side. That's bogus. Soft locked. Can't do this because that's got the door jutting out. Unless we go, this is a lamp. And that we need a key for. Yep. This, this door over here. I did have a pulley thing. There's a key right there on your map, down below, bottom left, in that flame of circles. Now... Maybe you, like, do it again? Ooh, go around the corner right here, on the I wall. did, I did. Damn it. It showed that button. That's a nice looking button. Oh, should I have nothing? Dang. So maybe that's where the key drops after you press that button. Okay. But we need to press that button. Can I, oh, I can do it up there. Never mind. Yep. There yep. we okay. go. There we go. I just saw that button. I'm like, oh, I just can't get that there. I guess I'll have to come from the inside. And uh, what a fool I was. Foolio. It's okay. We're all a bit of a fool. <laughs> there we go. And there we go. The dungeon item is the BFG. <laughs> <laughs> babies. Big fan of the giant? They are babies. Oh, wait. They're very cute. I feel very bad doing this. Yeah. Yeah, Link gets his uh, glory kill ability here too, so he'll be flashing orange and I can grab him. Yeah. Split him in half. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yay, we're on the other side. Yeah. What? Give me that. Well, I guess I could just cross over, right?
Uh, very cool. <laughs> Waiting for the Link's goo to recharge. Ravio's goo. I mean, actually, I guess. Because I can't get around this. Yeah, I can. Oh, good. Oh. Okay. It all makes sense. That is the will of the gamer right there. What would it make sense? The winder of a shoemaker. Right, Katie. No, that one, that the one was for Katie, but I yeah. got no response. So I, s <laughs> I see. I, no, I it said. did not come across. <laughs> uh -oh. Okay. Why are you over here? Wait, the wind stopped. Maybe the other wind is going. Can you cross this wall now? No. What the heck? We need to get over there. Well, we just go back through that room. I guess. Go the long way. Or this way. Oh. Yeah. Arrow! No. Or boomerang. Alright. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> oh, that was... <laughs> I thought for sure I was dead. <laughs> he would crush me. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, if I would... <laughs> Just jump right over. <laughs> Hot garbage. Whee! We did it! Oh, no. You're watery, so it just sounds like this weird, uh... Oh. <laughs> it just sounds like this weird, like, rambling. I mean, it kind of was. <laughs> <laughs> it's the hot garbage. Hot butter garbage. Hot butter hot garbage. garbage. Hot... It's, I said hot garbage. Da -da -da -da. Oh. It's got a temperature of 103. And, that's, and then I said, that's all I knew, that's all. Oh, I did damage to him with the... with the torch. Hmm. That seems wrong. <gasps> hmm... Okay. Whoa! Oh! Oh, they jump! Okay, so the ones that are falling are are, are dead. Okay. Jerks. Cool. Oh. Well, I. Oh my god, are these. I can just 
flutter up there? No. Uh. Oh, it didn't even matter. And yeah, that you can't move when you flutter up. Oh, you're right. I forgot. There we go. Well, I am actually uh, not pl not pleasantly surprised, but I'm I'm satisfied with how this game is running because I was a little, little worried the way it would load in new new textures and stuff like that. Um, it would stutter a little bit, and I was like, well, that sometimes means uh, some of the crazier shit that happens might slow it down, but so far so good. Yay! I'd actually say this runs almost better than Other M did. Oh. I feel like Dolphin was a, is a, um, typically, it's been around longer, so. Wait. What's up? You want to go get the other chest, which is probably nothing, maybe rubies? Oh, this, yeah. Yeah. I guess the, kind of the whole reason we did that. No, you you had to get a. I feel like you had to do that for something. Or maybe not. Yeah, you had to get a key. Did I get the key you in that room? All the way. There. No, it was in the other room, but it was on the other side of the wind. This so you game... had to go through the left side to go back to the other side. This game doesn't have the massive frame rate hit from loading in Zubook's Tiger or 3D Baja Blast Armor. That's true. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, to be fair, the worst part of that run was the, um, of that game, that game running, was the, um... Yeah! <laughs> was the, uh, the gravity thing. And that boss sucked <laughs> anyway, so... Oh, yeah. That game sucked. It did, didn't it? It's, I knew too. I, I'm sorry, I did not like that game. No, it, it, it was a bad game. Um, not the worst to play. It's it's. Can it's you fun. hammer it? Oh no, that works just fine. There's <laughs> <laughs> like fleshy mouths. Yeah, I don't know what's at the top. That's gonna let out the eyeball. I think a Metroid enemy. Wow, 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 wow. Yeah, this boss would look cool in 3D. I should turn it on. Oh, I like its horror mouth at the top. That's what we were talking mm -hmm. about, yeah. It's, yeah. It's... Ah! Uh, at least it doesn't start you at, like, a lower level of the dungeon. You have to climb back up. Like some other bosses. Burger. 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 <laughs> they did kind of fix it. it. You fall down to, like, a lower level, you do have to hop back up, but, like, it's not... Ooh, I couldn't do anything. Mm-hmm. Is this related to the like like? I don't know. Almost it feels like it could be. It, yeah, it could be. Let's check. Let's check that out. <laughs> oh, happy 2013. <laughs> That's right. And weird, weird, uh, like, uh, I don't know what's going on with Tinkerbell I down there. Sonic people, what? The International no, House like of White Lakes. we have Lumpy, <laughs> but, like, Sonic's there. Yes, Lumpy is now a mainstay. I actually have a transition with Lumpy, but it's not that great. 
because it's slumpy. You. So that boss's name was Margo Mill. What? Yeah. I know a Margo. <laughs> oh, it's like a mill, windmill here. Mm hmm. Uh, okay. This a towering boss is one of the first boss fights you encounter. The face is strange. Uh, you face a strange boss at the end of the trials of the House of Gales. While, while Margo Mill may look intimidating, you can defeat this uh, thing quickly if you follow the same pattern by hitting its weak point, its eye. As it spins around the area, uh, let me read this first and then I'll let you know if there's anything important besides how to kill it. I think we'll end the night on grabbing the Master Sword. Where is she? Where's our witchy friend? Oh well. Invisible. Eat it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so I was thinking about making uh, some wings. And hold on, hold on to your, your butts with this one. I was thinking of doing it with, uh, breading them with crushed Doritos. <gasps> oh, oh, no! It sounds so good! Right, it sounds pretty good, and I was gonna air fry it. Cool ranch or regular? So that was, I was thinking about getting both, and then kind of mixing them up. Not mix, yeah, not, not mix it up, but have, like, some are cool ranch wings, some are nacho cheese. And then some are both! Oh, shit. You can't you have to do it. Too. Let me know how it goes. Why not? You can't. It's it, anything you want. You will awaken horrors that you cannot imagine. Ugh, I want these horrors. <laughs> um, so I found a typo. Um, because it's telling you how to kill this Margo Mill, and then all of a sudden, in the middle of it, it says you can also hit Moldorm in the head with the hammer to briefly stun it. No, oh. <laughs> that's not. It's not Moldorm. But I'm guessing you could probably hit Moldorm in the head to briefly stun it with a hammer. Because Moldorm's the first boss, we thought. Moldorm is the burger. I like the burger. I like the look of the burger. Yeah. We're... I was not paying attention here. Should I have been? I got it. Okay. Don't worry. I like finding... Is it weird? It's probably a little weird. I like finding typos in textbooks and, like, guides to games. <laughs> no, it's, circle it's, them. it's fun. <laughs> I'll circle them and everything. I so, think I even sent Joe one once. I, th I sent you one. I was like, I took a picture. I was like, look, a typo in a Zelda guide. You probably don't care. Don't remember. So don't follow so the two of us. So the hates smoke? Question mark. Tell us more. <laughs> That's weird you, that you had like those mini slug dodongos in that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In that one. Like I thought the mid boss would almost like represent what the mate bigger boss would be. Not that one. That's how we go down. Oh, very well done. Oops. What if I did that? Three of us. Fuck. <gasps> Pree. <-hee -hee. laughs> I missed it. <laughs> oh, I wasn't looking either. I think probably to the right, but I'm probably wrong. I think it was left. Okay. So the fiery Dodongo slugs, their names are Heedle. Heedle? H E E D L E. That one makes no sense. Maybe it was like H E E T, like Heedle? And a Beetle? 
Hmm. What happened to the game? Oh, Ow. it hung up. <laughs> Don't follow us. Okay. They're all standing by each other. Not that time. No. Down. Go. Oh. Yeah, I think so. I didn't know down was an option. Be sure to choose I mean, wisely. Down. If you die, the ghost looking game. <laughs> looking game you die in real life. That's true. <laughs> uh, it's a good thing I didn't <gasps> mess that up at all. There's nothing in these bushes. Stop it! Stop it! You're ruining the moment! <laughs> this was a very big thing for me when in Link to the Past when I actually got the Master Sword. I never owned Link to the Past. I always rented it. And there are You got the Master Sword, a blade for true hero, which fires beams on the Hithel Hill. That's cool. Yeah. Hey. Here may be a tip. Hey. So this guy's kind of like your, your sage guide. Mm -hmm. Do you like this guy or... Better. The guy from Ocarina of Time. <laughs> Raru or whatever? Raru. Oh, yeah. Raru. Father Dennis? Like Father Dennis. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you're not wrong. Uh, I'm going home. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. Uh, I think I like Sarasahala better. Than Raru. Yeah. Raru just kind of chilled there and. So kinda... Raru was also the owl. Was he? Kaita Gagara? Yeah. He is? That's not. Shut up. <laughs> That's always what I thought it was. I thought it was just an owl I that mean... also wanted, like, had a vested interest in you succeeding. I thought it was, like, Raru, like, influencing you through the owl. Oh? I don't know where I made that up from. It just sounds good. Great, right? Hey, see? Wait. Hmm. Arrows? I my. Yeah, I would get arrows. Straight up from those. Arrows or bombs. I mean, you could probably afford a lot, but not all of them. Hmm. This is really where the whole chunk of the game... Oh yeah, that's half off. Mm -hmm. Normally 800. Yep. So I'll... Uh, eh, should I wait for something, or should I get something else while I'm here? No, this is all the money is good for, or rupees are good for in the game, is, okay. is buying out Rabio, really. Yeah, we'll buy bombs on too. Permanent! And then we'll go, uh, see my my. My my! My 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 Maya. Oh? Ooh, I like this. Press your equipped item, oh. Wait, do I have to, like, tap it? I see. Okay. I think I would prefer just to do my normal thing, but that's okay. Yeah, actually, I don't... Well, I, I don't can... Remember that at all. I can map something to, um... to click that, so I can maybe just use that. Well, I don't know. I don't know. No, I don't... I don't... No, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't I would use it. I forgot about that quick equip already. Oh, 
Oh, I think you need ten. Ten. Oh, I only thought yeah. you got like three. Eight no, nine. I've been getting them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just angry I feel Link. Like I collected all those. You do? I think I did. You can because they do uh, a good there's a map and that shows you like how many are in each section. Yeah, 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 yeah. They do a good job of like guiding you enough. Yeah. yeah. That or it's getting close. I can't remember. We'll go up there oh, next time, but um, Scruffy up there. He does nothing. Yeah, well, we'll... I heard it. I heard it. Did you? It might be up there. I mean, we could also just grab one next time. I hear it. I heard chickens. Mm -mm. Oh, now I hear it, yeah. Hmm. Roll into the tree. Cannot roll. Oh my god, what kind of game you is need, this? Uh, Pegasus needs to do that. Yeah. I know. Check I feel like the pot. 99% of these are Pegasus boots. <laughs> Which means only I, you can only acquire one without the pegs. <laughs> uh. Oh. There's a hundred. Looks like there's one up by the sanctuary on a wall. I don't remember you grabbing that. Well, I better do it. Yeah, yeah. Sanctuary. And then there's one in the pond west of the sanctuary. Yeah, she's gone. That's sad. There it is. I see it. Um, just go left. It's not physically on the sanctuary. It's just by it. It's on this wall to your left. Pop! You did it. Now we have to go talk to Mother. Bring her <laughs> back to the baby. The baby. The baby. I miss the baby. Do you? No. I mean, the baby itself was the only good thing. <laughs> now, if you can change the textures of the Mai Mai's to look like Metroid babies, that'd be cool. Hmm. That'd be tough, but maybe, actually. Just do a skin over it. <laughs> Hey, Teledan. It's the man of homps and gomps. That's me. <laughs> hey, Teledan. We're about to, actually just about to wrap up. But Ryan forced me to do this. Yes, I did. Uh, bow? Bow. The bow? I think you have to own it. Why it's not? Bow with bows. Yeah, bow. I mean, you might as well bust, or, you know... Buff up the bow since you bought it. Oh shit. Hell yeah. It's not the BFG 3000. <laughs> <laughs> I like this music. Bye, <laughs> bye. This is really good. Mm -hmm. Cute. Been working lately, haven't been able to catch the streams. Holidays, yeah, we are. We actually, I think, uh, managed to have a pretty good Christmas with the family, so. Um, I uh, have to decide what I'm gonna do for New Year's Eve. Tentatively, we'll still be doing Demon's Souls that night, but uh, I must discuss. So, I mean, um, I'm not doing anything. 
Yeah, I know. <laughs> not either. But, <laughs> You're um, not even gonna ask me. It doesn't matter. <laughs> um. Yeah. So plan on Thursday will be Demon Souls. Um. Though I know folks might uh, might not be able to join just like Christmas Eve was, but that, mm -hmm. that was okay. Demon Souls drinking game. Holy no. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. It is New Year's and it is a Friday. That's the day I pop open the sparkly almond. You gotta get orange juice for that day, Katie. It's true. I should. You have lemon... lemoncello as well. I do have lemoncello. It's in the freezer. Darksborn demands souls. <laughs> <laughs> it will probably get mine. Um... Yeah, maybe. And then Saturday, oh, Saturday we have uh, we are we have Revengeance that we will be uh, doing the DLC for. What were you gonna say, Ryan? How would you drink for that game though? Every time you die, I mean, yeah, you are dying more often. You are dying more often. I mean, time you call it Dark Souls instead of Demon Souls. Oh no! What? Just just out of curiosity. Uh, what, how many, where am I at with that? That's not it. Elgato oh, Death. Time. There we go. 53 with, yeah. Hmm. We'll see. I'll come up with something. It's a good drawing. I don't That's remember drawing. doing that, but yeah. I did it. <laughs> That's gonna do it for tonight. We got far. Yeah, yeah, we, we got we did the first two dungeons and got the master sword. Mm -hmm. So what? We just get waltz right in there and finish things off. That's it. It'd be great. Um, that was a huh? That was Raiden. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. A lot. Um, mm -hmm. I'll put the game back on. Um. More by consensus as decreed by Ryan and Katie. <laughs> you yeah. just tell me when to drink. <laughs> I mean, we'll probably come up with stuff as the game goes on. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, that's pretty much it. Um, I don't know. I hear that squeak, though. I do, yeah, too. That, that my mind is close somewhere. Um, I don't know where it is. Back of the house? Right there. It's on the back of the house. All right, You're welcome. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, Thanks, Teladan. <laughs> uh, yeah, so uh, we'll be back uh, Thursday. If you uh, if you cannot join us, have a safe and happy New Year. Uh, if you can join us, then get ready for some, I guess, some drinking games with Demon Souls. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! I know <laughs> that'll be fun. That just sounds like it's gonna be a train wreck. If that'd be fun for death. That will be fun. Mm -hmm. uh, all right. Yep. Uh, have a good night, everybody. We'll see you next time. Toodaloo. Hey, bye bye. Yep. Bye.